Okay, we're just going to go through the features of the Behringer XR12 mixer, which we've got organised into a custom mobile rack for a school in South Australia. And down the bottom here, we've got a power amp because we're running passive speakers with this particular unit for the main out left and right. And we've got our CD and audio source player, a couple of uh, wireless mic receivers for our Sennheiser uh, mic transmitters. And up the top here, we've got the Behringer XR12 unit. All right, so first thing we need to do is connect to it. One of the nice things about the XR is it has its own built-in Wi-Fi router. So if I turn the mixer on, which it already is, all I need to do in Windows is come into my network settings and just find the XR12 in the Wi-Fi networks available. Click on that one, choose connect. And as long as the network's open, it will just go ahead and connect. You can set it up with a password if you need to. Okay, so we're in. And now we just need to click on set up at the top here. And sometimes this window hides behind the XR panel, which you can see that's already on screen. So I'll just uh, click the bottom application icon in Windows here. Click on the panel I want. And we can now see the setup dialog. So here I need to click on the mixer uh, that we've found on this network and choose connect. And it will ask me, do I want to send the settings from the PC to the mixer uh, or from the mixer to the PC? So in this case, I've got the settings in the mixer already, so I'll choose mixer to PC. And that'll transfer the parameters across and we'll see a few little changes happen. A couple of preset fader positions from last time I was logged into it have been recalled and we're ready to go. Let's <laughs> go.